Hey home bakers, it's Jack here, bakewithjack.co.uk, bringing your weekly bread making tip every single Thursday. And today is a practical tip, and it's a brand new uh, loaf shaping technique that I learned at a local bakery. Hey everybody, if you follow me on social media, you'll know that I'm not a baker, but I've been spending a day a week in a local baker's working there for the day. It's been awesome for the last few months, and I thought I'd share with you today the bloomer shaping technique that Paul the Baker uses at the Baker Boys in Hook in Hampshire. Okay, here we go, I've got my dough here. I've got my little box of flour to help me out, and I've got the Bake With Jack dough scraper. Super handy piece of plastic. This is what we're gonna do, right? This has rested up as a whole for about an hour as a dough, and then I shaped it into a ball and let it rest for another half hour to come back up again, a little touch to let it relax, so I'm able to shape it nicely. Here goes, right? First things first. A little dust of flour. The smallest dust you could possibly get away with when you're shaping up doughs. Flip it upside down onto the table like this and give it a little push. Now, fold, push, fold, push. I'm just trying to make it a bit longer like this. Right, this is how they go. Now, knuckles, like this. Down, 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 down. Right, I'm degassing it slightly, but I'm just making a nice platform for me to bring these two ends in. Stretch, like this. Fold in that one, fold in that one. Now we've got a rectangle. Push with your knuckles like this, down, down, down. Evenly flat again, so we've got a rectangle, but it's evenly flat on the top like that. Now, check it doesn't stick, and if it is sticking like mine, just get a little dust underneath. Nothing major, just the tiniest amount. Now, starting at the top, I'll take this down, down with my knuckles once again, to stick that top, and then we're gonna roll it and push it in as we go, building that tension up. Roll, push, roll, push, roll, push, roll, push, roll, push. Give it a roll my hand like this, Seam side underneath, give a little dust, and we're done. That's it, simple as that. So there you have it, super tight loaf, rolled up and ready to go, and that's how they do it at the Baker Boys in Hook in Hampshire. They take it to local markets, hundreds of loaves are shaping by hand every single day, uh, and it's awesome. I always love learning new shaping techniques. I think it is wicked, and I hope to share a few more with you in the future. Give it a go, and if you want to learn more about what I do on a daily basis, going to the bakery, working as a chef, and all this stuff in my actual life, um, I've been writing blog posts about it in a little diary on my website. So head over to the blog, click on diary entries, and you'll see there's one there called A Chef in a Baker's World, uh, which I wrote recently, I'm really pleased with. I'm not very good at writing, but it's nice and interesting for you guys to see what I'm up to. I think that'd be cool. So I'll link that up underneath, and you can go and read my blog if you like. And in the meantime, I will see you next week. Bye bye.